guys. Happy Sunday. <laughs> From me and Cody. Cody's in the back seat resting. We just checked out of my hotel. I'm trying to talk loud because it is pouring down rain. Very, very yucky day. Very. Anyways, I checked out of the hotel. working in a state park and I had to take him with me to work there and you know you just make do you do what you gotta do I couldn't drop him at my mom's it'd be an extra over an hour of extra driving I just can't do that so <clears throat> he's with me <laughs> my plan is after work tonight I am heading back to my mom's for the night just kind of taking things day by day slept really good last night. I'm happy. So yeah. I did want to say one more thing and then I am not my channel I am moving on with my life. I don't want anything to do with ITH. I don't want them having anything to do with me. Leave me alone. I'm gone from there. You got me out of there. That's your wish. Leave me alone. I'm getting tired of it. I have gone on Facebook sites, and I've seen horrible, horrible things said about me. I don't know if they don't think I can see it. I actually went on and commented, and I know they deleted it, and that's fine because I already screenshotted quite a bit because that's called slandering and trying to ruin somebody's um, YouTube channel and trying to destroy my character and me. That's sick. And you know what? I know the people that know me and know my character. They know the truth. And to certain women on there, pretty sure they're residents. I know I've, I've uh, had employees. But the things you say and that, you know, on an ITH site and that they allow that. And they condone that and they probably encourage it. That would be really worrisome to me. I don't think that's very professional of a company. And then again, what do I know? Not professional at all. But go ahead and, and slander me. Call me a scammer. I really don't understand that. I have never once asked for a dime. I have never started a GoFundMe any, during any of this. So I don't know where these people, they're just like grasping for anything. And I know, ignore, ignore. And I am after this, but I have a right. When I left ITH, I knew I had my chance to defend myself and my mom against lies, against their slander. And I could finally tell the truth what happened to us. And that's what I did. But after this, I'm done with it because I don't want anything to do with ITH. Nobody, nothing with them. I am moving on with my life, you know. I think they need to do the same instead of, you know, it's almost stalkerish. 
But anyway, to the scammer, lady that says I'm such a scammer, I'm sure she watches YouTube and sees that many YouTubers get mail, packages, money sent to them. I mean, people send that to me and I'm honestly astounded. I, I was thinking yesterday how I don't even deserve it, but I definitely appreciate it. You know, I'm like, I'm nothing special. I'm just, just me doing YouTube and, you know, my misadventures in life. But I definitely appreciate that you guys do that for me. It makes me feel really special because especially when these people are just constantly putting me down for no reason. It's so hurtful and rude. But I hope when you're, you know, well, I don't believe a word she says. I don't believe a word she says. But you'll believe every word ITH says, don't you? That's weird, isn't it? So just like you choose to believe every single word ITH says, I have my people that believe me and my character. So you, you need to move on, lady. After I called her out on that, I did, you know. I've screenshotted things and, and I'm, I'm done. You know, they can feel happy about that. But the only thing I say is, if I'm a scammer, then what are they because what is this key money like I never watch your videos ever but I've heard about the key money and I don't understand what that is you're not buying a lot right you're renting it why why do you have to pay 15 25 30 thousand so is that you're just giving them money you're just giving them money outright to what have have a lot and I'm a scammer Okay, that makes sense. Okay, anyway, I'm done. I'm done with them. My life, I'm moving on. Next stage in life, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know where I'm going to be. Take it day by day. But I just wanted you to know I really appreciate you guys being so kind to me. You guys standing behind me, sticking up for me with all these people that are just... I call them the uh, Randy worshipers who just see blindly and, and everything they say. But leave me out of stuff. I'm gone and away from there. Just let me be. I'm trying to find where I'm going to live, what I'm going to do. That's my priority. So you guys, when you send stuff and you help me, help me stay in a hotel, I hope you know how much that really means to me. Because it, it really does, literally, it keeps me going. That, just you guys supporting me and Cody. Cody. <laughs> that's all. That's all that's keeping me going right now. It really is. So thank you. Hey, Cody. We made it to Sevierville. You going with Mama to work today? Cody. You going to work with Mama? Yeah? <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs> I love when he does that. Sorry, I, I slept good, but I am still so tired. Just so tired. <laughs> Cody gets to rest in the car when I'm working. Made it here. Gotta go get some coffee for sure. Getting closer. I see it. At least they have Duncan. And get some good coffee to power through my day. Cody. Cody got this before work. <laughs> He's gonna be a good boy while I'm working all day. I got this. Oh my gosh. I need a little coffee before work. A toasted white mocha latte with skim milk. Mmm. Oh gosh. Mmm. That's good. 
Hopefully that's gonna make me power through my day. <laughs> So I left Newport, what, 10, 10 o'clock. It's 11.15, I'm really just now. Um, well, I'm finally done at Duncan. And, whoa, oh my gosh. Got my coffee ready for work. Head over to work, then I gotta take Cody out. Thankfully, I'm just hoping it stops raining for a few minutes so I can just take him out to go potty. And I'm gonna head into work. So mad these people you know when I go across the crosswalk and I know a lot of people are waiting I don't just sit there and film things and laugh and take my time I get my butt across other people need to uh, learn that all right made it to work it's busy crazy again like usual um, Cody <laughs> gonna be an interesting day uh, luckily it's not a really long shift he'll be okay it's not hot out it's not too cold he loves the chili so I'm just gonna come out and check on him and you know do what I have to do he'll be all right got this working on it and yeah that's it guys I'm going into work and after this I'm headed back to my mom's for the night so you guys have a good have a good Sunday. Be glad you're not at the outlets. <laughs> it's so busy. All right, I'll check in later, guys. Bye. <laughs>